We're installing a huge tank for Lusso's Auto Spa, and we put a lit up version of their logo in the center. But when we filled the tank up with water, the opaque part turned clear. Oh, he didn't sand it enough. When Redneck made the whole logo, he sanded it so you can get the light going through it. And what happened is, once it hit the water, you can see through it. That, that's a big problem. I mean, you can't fix that like that. Can we put a piece of white behind that? Acrylic? Dude, it has to be cut perfect. It has to cover that. Well, it should still have the program and the machine. They could cut it again. Let's get a piece of white acrylic over here quick. We'll figure it out. I called the shop, and they had it cut immediately, and they drove it over right away. Teamwork makes the dream work, baby. Is he? Hey, what's going on? So listen, we got to replace that. We got to take that off, line it up with this, drill the holes, and then put this right on. So you got to go in the tank. In. All the way in. The good news is, I got your pink goggles. Oh, sweet. And you have four screws. You have to pull them off. Give me that cover. We have to drill this to match it, put it on the back, and then screw it back on. OK. When I get out, it's gonna, I'm going to get water all over those lights. Can we turn the power off so I don't get electrocuted? That would ruin my day. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll turn it off. Yeah, tell me when. All right. You good now? Oh, I'm great. I'll just pretend I'm on vacation. Dude, the water's 78. It's like going into, like, Hawaii. Oh. Ah. He can hold his breath pretty long. You got one left. So where is it? Bottom center. It's the last one? Yep. OK. Try to separate it now. All right, I got it. No, Izzy, you got two choices. Uh, what? You can get out now, or you can stay in there, and I can drill this out. How long is that going to take? Maybe 15 minutes. Yeah, you know what? If I get out, I'm going to make a mess. The white acrylic was cut to size, but we still have to drill holes through it to match the holes in the face of the logo. All right, now we have to get it back in place. All right, there you go. Izzy, you ready? Yeah. Now, let's get it down. What a difference already. Brad, look at that. All right, here we go, first one. An adult Koran angel. You can tell it's an adult because the juvenile stripes are all gone. I like the sparkles on it. It looks like the Bugatti with the gold sparkles. All right, Brett, what's next? Coral hogfish. Dude, this tank's so big, this fish is going to love it. These guys make great tank mates. They're going to clean parasites off some of the other fish. There he goes, right to the spa. Last but not least, striped sweet lips. Nocturnal predators to come out at night. They like to eat crustaceans. I love the stripes. Like pinstripes. Yeah, just not like on all the cars. Nice, right up to the coral reef. You gotta clean this thing up and then show this thing off. So let's get this thing done, all right? All right, let's do it. While Brett wipes down the new tank, I have something to do on the reef aquarium. A nice little surprise fish. Scott Velvet Brass. It's gonna do great in this reef tank. There you go, buddy. You got a male and you got a female. Nice little special fish. A little gift, he'll be happy. Maybe he'll let me take the car out for a weekend. Now it's time to show off the big bad tank. Let's make sure. That's good. Look good? That's good. All right, we're good. Team Lusso, come on in! It was like way better than even the Roadster I just picked up. It's been a hobby of mine for a little more than 10 years now. I've got a little bigger and bigger and bigger each time, and then, you know, when I walked in and the tank was set up, it was a dream come true. The tank here is 14 feet long, three feet wide, six feet tall. It's 1,900 gallons, okay? Wow. wow. Awesome. That's incredible. I think our logo is, a, is, a, is probably the best part because it kind of shines and it's the centerpiece of the tank. It's a big statement. As soon as you walk in, boom, you have the cars, then you have the tank. This matches the hyper cars that we have here. For People sure. Start calling us stuff like hyper tanks. Hyper tanks. <laughs> there, you, there you go. So all the coral is molded off a of real coral. We 
didn't do the whole backdrop in coral. We wanted to give you the effect of like looking that it's going further. So we added a deep blue uh, to give you that effect. Um, also too, you guys wanted something very sleek and slick that was gonna fit in with what you got. It's exactly what I think we all had in mind. You guys have well over 100 fish in here. Wow. wow. Some of the special fish in here that are actually really cool. Uh, we got some unique stuff, kind of like you guys have one of one, you know, unique cars. We got you some really, really unique fish. So uh, first off, we have the Sohal Tang. It comes from the Red Sea. It's one of the rarest tangs that are out there. These guys are in the surgeon family. They actually have scalpels that they use to protect themselves. That's why they call them surgeon fish. Also too in here, you have a, a parrot fish right here. And those guys at nighttime, they actually sleep. They're actually one of only fish that lay down and spin a cocoon around themselves um, at nighttime when they sleep. Also too, you have an orange spot tusk. Now this guy is actually really cool and really rare. They actually take their crustaceans, their food, they pick them up and they actually throw them against rocks to break them. Wow. wow. Um, it's a really rare thing that the fish do. They also go to the top and spit water. Nobody knows why they do that, but it's just one of the things that these guys do. So you got some pretty rare, unique fish in here. Uh, they're all community fish. They're all gonna get along well with each other. One of the coolest things I noticed is like the squibble angel. I know they're really rare. I just love like how all the colors came together. It, it looks incredible. It looks incredible. Allowing the fish to go in and tuck in and out, but still giving it to look like you're looking deeper into the ocean, I think. It's a pretty cool effect. Great details, great details. It's an amazing upgrade from the small tank. And on top of that all, you know, after the girls were here, you know, they were real excited. They wanted to do something special. So on your reef tank, after moving it, they came up with an idea to get you guys a little surprise, which is a fish for the reef. They got you a Scots Velvet Wrasse, which is actually a beautiful wrasse. Doesn't get too big and too oh, small, but thank you. in your tank over there too, thank so. You. The fish are amazing. I mean, the, the variety, the amount of fish that they put in there, it's what we were missing in that space for sure. Doing this tank is definitely special. Getting in the car, cruising, it's very exciting, you know? So I'll definitely be back down here visiting and stuff. If by some chance one is missing, <laughs> look for this guy. Thank you guys again for creating such a dream come true for us. This is... This is great. Absolutely awesome. And we'll see you guys soon. It's been a pleasure. Right. Fellas, Thank you. Thank you. I got to make them go work. Right. Enjoy Thank the aquarium, you. guys. Take care. Look at all the fish.